All right, so we can see with this runner here, all right, he's a sprinter, but it makes it really obvious to see right there is his terminal forward swing and he starts to pull the leg backwards as the leg is coming down to the ground so that he's striking the ground on a backward traveling leg. Thus, all of his hip extensor muscles and his torso rotator muscles and his pelvic rotator muscles are all working together to get him to strike the ground in the direction that essentially the ground is traveling underneath him as he's going over the top of the ground. So the body's going forwards, the leg is going backwards, the ground is essentially relative to the body going backwards. That's the really important part. If two surfaces meet and collide, if they're both traveling in the same direction, the impact is less. If two surfaces collide and they're going in opposite directions, the impact is much, much higher.